Good morning everyone and welcome to Fuzzy Ferret Farm in Stardew Valley on the first of winter. Ah, oh, it is good to be in the best season of the year. However, what isn't good is that I passed out at the end of the last one. Shh, don't tell anyone. Now, let's see what's on the television. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. Winter. A time when all the world goes quiet. Now is a great time to do some mining, fishing, and gathering. Upgrade your tools in preparation for a productive spring, or get your local carpenter to build something on your farm. Stock up on resources, upgrade, and prepare for the next year. Very well. Fortune teller. How's things going? Well, the spirits are very happy. They also enjoy winter. Oh, you can tell the spirits are good spirits if they enjoy winter. Bundle up, folks. It's going to snow tomorrow. Okay. Very, very well. Uh, okay, well, let's go and see what's going on. Oh, my lord. Dear Abak, nothing is more satisfying than cooking with fresh vegetables from your own garden. I've enclosed a recipe to help you out. Take care. Parsnip soup. I've got some parsnips. And... Dear Mr. Abak, last night a Joja team member found you incapacitated on your own farm. Don't ask why the Joja team member was there. You don't need to know such things. A medical team was dispatched, however, to bring you home safely. It was about, I don't know... The 10 meters. We're glad you're okay. You've been billed 1,000 gold for this service. Morris, Georgia Customer Satisfaction Representative. Morris, you are a thug. You probably came up behind me and clubbed me across the back of the head because clearly I didn't just fall asleep at 2 a.m. because I was tired. No. No, you helped me. I'm fairly certain with, I don't know, a blackjack. Dear Avak, you're such a good neighbor. I thought I'd send you some over some animal feed to make your job easier. Thank you, Mommy. That'll actually be really super helpful um, in the winter. Thank you. Oh, I see. I see. There's someone there. I think not. Be gone. Also, be gone. There we are. Ah, uh, the world looks pretty right now. Right, we're going to need to do a whole bunch of things. Let's go and grab you. Uh, unfortunately, we didn't get anything good from there. Let's uh, top these back up, shall we? Pom -pom. There we are. Right, we'll go and get this going straight away. I can hear something. There is something out here that needs to be gotten. I am not going to water Leafin's bowl. The reason being... Leafin, I'm fairly certain, is going to be able to, to get water from the numerous other places that water exists on the farm. Just not in that bowl, because if I do, it's just going to ice over, and then you'll stick your tongue to it. Don't even pretend you wouldn't, Leafin, I know you. Hello, 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 and hello also. Right. Uh, let's just go ahead and lay all of this down there. There we go. Ah, oh, that's grand. And then we'll pop that back in there. Right, let's have a look. How much have we got on there? We've got a very great deal. We, we we did a good job, at the very least, of getting all of the um, hay cut. Oh, well, you know, the vast majority of it cut. How are the bats doing today? Oh, still nothing. Hmm. Well, I'll clear everything up at the very least, and we'll see what we can get. Hopefully we can get something else fairly soon, something other than the orange, because we do need other things. Uh, we'll drop that off. Um, I think we'll keep the black... No, we won't keep the black fruit. We'll, we'll drop that off into here as well. There we are. The orange, though, that is going somewhere else entirely. Do I have anything in this chest? No, I do not. I probably don't actually need to worry too much about that chest at the moment. I can probably repurpose that one. Right, now, there was something in the water somewhere. Let's go and have a quick look around. Ooh, we've got a little uh, seed there. We've also got some wiggly worms over here. Yes, winter root. Not what we need, though. We need, I believe, the crystal fruit and the crocus. The crocus and the crystal fruit. That is what we're looking for right now. Nothing. Okay, well, these trees can just hang tight and, and grow. Because if I chop them down, they'll never come back. Um, right, you're going to be replaced, I'm afraid. How many crows have you scared off? You scared off two crows. You were not very useful where you were, but still, I thank you for your for your efforts. Let's pop you down right about there, I would say. Pomp. Uh, let's go and uh, see the cows. Hello. 
David looks really happy. Is one month old. Is no longer a baby. Ah, oh, fantastic. Let's get some hay for you, shall we? There we go. Now we may, in fact, be able to milk them. There we go. We've got milk. This is a good day. Very good day indeed. Ah, uh, so much milk. So much milk. It is grand. Okay, so we've got three milk. Oh. Why? Oh, three silver star milks. That is actually pretty bloody impressive, I must say. Pretty bloody impressive. Right, well, we want... Oh, there we are. I see you. Fear not. I have spotted you over there. I've still got the milk pail with me. That's not what I wanted. We've got four iron ore. That is pretty pretty good return, actually. Let's go in and drop off the milk pail. We don't need it with us. Now, the thing that I'm thinking is... Where do I want to put the the, the cow... The, the Like, the, the milk... The, the Sorry, the cheese press. Because I've got the mayo machines just outside the coop, but that's not the ideal location either. Realistically, I would prefer to have that somewhere else. Maybe even inside. You know what, yeah, I think I think I should put the the devices that service that particular animal, especially with the barns, because some of the barns will have pigs, so there's no point in having a cheese press outside there or inside the barn which has pigs in it. They should only be inside the location which uh, will actually um, service that uh, produce. So the cheese press is in places where I get milk, so the goats and the cows. We do have ancient seeds. We've got the crystal fruit, actually. Oh, what was it that I needed, then? For the craft bundle. Let me go and find. Oh, we need a snow yam and a crocus. Sorry, not crystal fruit. My bad. Okay, well... Um, we do have... Five... Uh, iron ore. Do we have any... No, we don't. We do not have any coal yet. Well, I can easily fix that, though. Let's go ahead and pop that in there. Over here, we are going to put in the mail. We've got gold star mail, which is fantastic. We have... Uh, nothing else that we really want to pop in there just yet. What I would like to do... Because all we need for the pantry... The artisan bundle, any cheese will do. So I just need a single cheese press to make a single cheese, and we finish that bundle... Over here, need a large milk or a duck egg. Either or, once we've got it, we've got the greenhouse and everything becomes easier. Oh, my Lord. I think I'll drop those ones off, though. Uh, we'll just have the uh, higher tier one there. There we go. We can make an omelette. Ah, oh, fluffy goodness. Yes, I will take one omelette. Um, I think I need a fried egg as well for the community centre. So I might as well bring that with me. Now, it is a Monday, so there's not actually a lot for me to do right now. Um, other than make a few things. So, let's see. Can I make the cheese press? Yes, I can. Let's go and pop this cheese press into the barn. I'll check on it later. It'll be fine. Uh, realistically, I wouldn't mind having a few of them. I need more copper bars for it, though. I should have really thought about that. Uh, let's pop that over here, then. And then pop the milk in there. Uh, uh, scallywags! It took the milk out of my inventory! I should have noticed this. <laughs> I'm such a derp. Oh, how do you put up with me? Genuinely, how on earth do you put up with me? Why do you put up with me? This must hurt your brain as much as it hurts mine. It, it hurts mine more, I assure you, but you're still inflicting pain upon yourselves. <sighs> right, um, well, the grapes and the blackberries, they can go elsewhere. They, they, honestly, they can go in here. We don't need to be storing those outside. Um, anything else I want to pop in here right now? Uh, the winter roots can go in there, that's fine. Pop those in as well. Uh, Strange Bun is coming with me, though. I need to grab... Uh, you know what, I'll just... I'll grab... All of them. Alright, I want one more cheese press. 
I want another cheese press, actually. I need a little bit more stone, a little bit more wood for that. I would also like a tree tap, which is going to require... A chunk more wood. Alright, well, I can carry this with me for now. I'll go and uh, put a little bit of milk into the cheese press, and when we come back later, we're going to have quite a few things that we're going to be able to do. It is going to be rather grand, I tell you. Thank you very much, girls. Right, let's get some coffee down us. Glug, glug, glug. And then we're going to make our way into the forest. Chop down a couple of trees, I think. If we can. Some of them should have regrown by now. Here's one. And we also got ourselves a pine cone. Fantastic. I almost called it an acorn. I know it's not an acorn, but it's just... I don't know why that name is more familiar to me. But because it's the, the significantly most uh, more familiar term, I just want to use it at all times. Even when I know it's not the right one. Language is tricky. And me being stupid does not make it any less tricky. There we go. Want some rocks now. We're going to need a lot of rocks, unfortunately. Let's grab you. Drop this one down as well. We'll go ahead and we'll collect the crystal fruit. The crystal fruit is actually worth an awful lot. Crystal fruit goes for quite the amount, but we're not going to be using it up like that. Oh, crocus, fantastic. Now all I need is... You know what? I can't do it there, damn. Uh, we need to find... Well, first, I need to make me a tree tap. Then I need to see what else I need for another cheese press. I just need 45 stone. How much have I got? I've got 17. <laughs> yeah, odds of me getting that uh, fairly slim. Still, I'll get all of these rocks simply because they're in the way, and I might as well. And then we'll continue looking for a the uh, root. Uh, what was it? Snow yam? Probably completely wrong with that. No, no, I was right. Hooray! Right, Hat Mouse. Do you have any hats that I would like, Hat Mouse? Uh, the Santa Hat. Hey, yo, Poke. Did you bring coins? Good. Me sell hats. The Pokebo Watermelon Band. Official Cap. Tucker Hat. Or Trucker Hat, rather. Tropic Clip. Daisy. Santa Hat. Tiara. Butterfly Bow. Lucky Bow. How did we get all these? The floppy old trapper with a creased bill. Looks like it's been through a lot. Achievement 15k. Uh, achievement 50k. Achievement a new friend. Achievement cliques. Achievement networking. Moving up. DIY. Artisan. Fisherman. Old mariner. Mother catch. Treasure tro trove. And gopher. Um... Sure, let's let's have a little bit of festive fun, shall we? <laughs> Good God. Uh, that's going to wear on me very quickly. But I hope the uh, townspeople will, will get some joy out of it all the same. Let's just get rid of this. I wonder if you can tap the trees just out in the Cintersnap Forest. Because you could, if you can, you'd get an enormous amount of uh, sap that way. An enormous amount. Right, here we go. Let's see what we get down here, shall we? We get... Five iron ore, my lord. Remarkable. Now, I need a snow yam. And yes, I do notice the wiggly worms, worry not. An ancient arrowhead. But what we really need is a snow yam. Really? Okay, I guess we're not going there then. Unfortunately, it is generally the best way just to dig massive uh, areas with the hoe. This is where again an upgraded hoe actually earns its keep. It's... Ah, there we go. Fantastic. Now, I could just go and complete the community. Ah, oh, fantastic. Right, that's all I needed. I wanted two. One to make into a seed pile, uh, sorry, uh, winter seeds, 
the other to turn into uh, turn in at the community center. So now we have all we wanted. Oh, and another lost book. Re really? Inventory full? You're kidding me. Um, what do I have that I flat out don't care about? I have nothing that I flat out don't care about. Oh, I guess winter roots. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, I should. You know what? Nom. There we go. You found a lost book. Fantastic. Right, let's be off. I want to go and visit uh, Jazz, actually. Really? Oh, I missed by ten minutes. You... How frustrating. I'm remarkably vexed. Remarkably vexed. But oh well. Not much we can do. Uh, let's go and collect cheese. Hello. Uh, we'll pop the other one in there. Okay, we've made some stonkingly good progress. Some truly amazing progress today. Alright, let's drop off all of the nonsense that we're carrying around for no good reason. The frozen geo, the omni geo, you, can, you guys can actually come with me. In fact, you can as well. Um, we've got Ah, we need another crocus. Oh, let's drop these off. There we are. Oop. I will be right back. And I'm back. Uh, it was the neighbor's children. They were doing a little little raffly sort of thing. So uh, I needed to put a pound into the kitty. Uh, let's see. Um, well, I've got enough now to get this going. So let's do that. Uh, let's also place that down. And do I have everything else I need? Uh, we've got the cheese. Yes, we do. Fantastic. Let's get on out there and go uh, to the community center. Get those things done. Also, wiggly worms. Now, we can place down the wild seeds if we wish. And we may as well at this point, because they will grow. You will get um, little bits and bobs, I believe. I think the wild... Well, actually, you know what? The wild seeds might not give anything. Because winter has no natural crops. There we go. You, I think you may need winter seeds specifically. But we now have the ability to make those anyway, so it's not going to be a problem for us. Okay, here we go. And artisan bundle complete. Now we're just waiting on one more thing. A keg. Very nice indeed. I am very pleased to have that. And the final things for this as well. There we go. And we get... 30 winter seas. Exactly what we needed. This is a good start to winter, in my opinion. First day, we've already completed two bundles. We're happy to help. It's not our house, after all. You can consider it your house. I'm sure no one will mind. Love this music. Such a good reward. Also need to drop off. Oh, I can't. Oh, yes, I can. Chef's bundle. And drop that off there. All we need now are the Mackey rolls and the truffles. <sighs> Somehow this feels right with my little hat. Let us dance. Ah, good times. Very good times. Right, now I've got to be off. Take care. Okay. So, with that done, with all of these seeds there, burning a hole in my, my tiny little pocket, it is time for us to get back to the farm. Uh, it's a good day today. Very good day. Oh, there's a quest. I want to pull a prank on my dad. I'll need a snow yam. Keep it secret. All right. I'll give her a shot. But that will use up my snow yam. Never mind, I've got winter seeds, so it doesn't matter. 
If Abigail wants a snow yam, I'll, I'll get her a snow yam. Is it going to be giving him something he's deathly allergic to? Because if so, I'm not sure I want to be part of that prank. Um... Let's see, where are we? We want... The, well, that one can go to Abigail. This can go in there, so can the crocus. In fact, the crocus can now be given to someone else. Which means I can sell this, uh, the crystal fruit, which is going to give us a reasonable amount of money. The drum can go, the arrowhead can go as well. Snow yam can go to Abigail. And with the last bits of our energy... We can go ahead and prepare this area for winter forage. And it's pretty much going to be the only thing that we can make money on during winter. So let's put in some effort here. There we go. I'm not going to uh, put it in areas where I'm going to need to water it myself. Simply because there's really no bone benefit to me doing that. None whatsoever. I'm not even sure I'm going to put down fertilizer. I guess I will simply because I've got so much in the way of um, sap. So there's no reason not to. Still. The first night I am going to have to water it though, unfortunately. And that's simply because it wasn't there. Uh, it, these areas ha weren't already um, prepared this morning when the sprinklers activated. And they won't activate again until tomorrow morning. It's a bit of a shame, but oh well. There we go. How long have we got? We've got plenty of time. We should be good. Right, time to start planting then. There we go. And four. Now, where is my watering can? Right, I'm just going to get these watered. On screen. The nice thing about winter, there's a lot of things I don't need to do. Uh, I'm not going to have to cut things out, for example. That does actually take a, a little bit of extra time in editing, which uh, all adds up. Oh, I missed one. Dread. Oh, well. I'm sure I'll be able to get more winter seeds um, soon ish. So it's not a gigantic issue. And we can just finish off that little area. It shouldn't take over long for it to all be ready. Right, so we'll drop this off. Where are you? There we go. That's the last time we're going to need you. Uh, yes, we probably should go and plump this down into the barn. Hello, slime. And because we can also then pop some of the milk in there as well. No star caryads. Oh, we've got to make some rapid progress up to the bed now so that we don't pass out outside. I was thinking about moving those, but they can be moved later. All I'll do is I'll drop that off there. Then we'll turn in. Wonderful. Right, I, since we, we're going to have a bunch of kegs, I'll place one down there. And we'll go ahead and I think we'll start making some pale ale straight away. Put some pale, some uh, hops in there. That'll be fine. In two days then, we'll have something yummy. Uh, we do now have cheese, which we can drop off. Which we will do now. Is there anything else I can make? I can make cheese cauliflower now. That's actually pretty awesome. The mackey roll, I'm going to need some seaweed and I'm going to need some rice. I can also make some pepper poppers, which is fantastic. I'm just going to leave those for now, though. That's something that I'll uh, work on later on. I can make farmer's lunch, which is an omelette and a parsnip, which gives plus three farming. Don't need it right now. Maybe I'll use that before I harvest my crops. I'm not sure what the farming proficiency adds, but I imagine it's something along those lines. But because we have completed the craft area, we're going to have a very fun place to go to tomorrow. We are going to be able to go to the quarry because the Junimo have completed the bridge. Uh, made a little bit of money. Not a lot. But that's going to be the way of winter, unfortunately. Progress has been saved. Okay. 
Right. Good morning. Check on the fortune teller. Mildly perturbed. Uh, that's okay. Uh, it's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Marvellous. Right. Got a few things I need to do. Hey, I've got a little challenge for you. Catch me a squid. You can fish them from the ocean at night. They only show up in the winter, though. Very well. I will do my best. Alright. Let's see what my crab pot's caught. I think we'll uh, swing by the ocean later on and uh, check that out. The sprinklers are sprinkling. Very good times. I should really drop my hat off, shouldn't I? Oops. Pump, pump. Put that leaf in. Alright, let's go and see the chickens. Uh, right, want to place... Sure, I'll place them over here. One can go there. And one can go right there. And uh, we can collect all the eggs up. Of course. Say good morning to all of the chickens. There we are. And uh, new, I want to get some hay. There we go. And because there are only six tiles empty, I can only pick up six. There we go. Uh, oh, actually, <laughs> left without putting any of the eggs in. Um, sure, we'll get the brown eggs being made into mayo. There we are. It's good that we're starting to get some uh, silver. Uh, Silver Star Produce already. That's actually pretty awesome. Nothing from the bat, unfortunately. Oh, well. Now, I believe that it will be Linus's birthday tomorrow, I think. I'm going to have to check the calendar, but I'm fairly certain I spotted that on the calendar when I was... Um, the last time I was looking at winter which was in the last series so I could easily be mistaken hello excuse me Flo ah oh, drat I picked up too much damn it Flo excuse me excuse me Flo thank you yes there we go right now I need to milk you thank you now, it's basically a race between you guys and the ducks. Who can give me... Oh, you win! Wow! You super win! You super duper win! I've already got a large milk. Well, there we go. Greenhouse is finished, I think. I was not expecting that. Wow. Okay. You are all awesome. And I thank you for it. Uh, right, well, genuinely wasn't expecting that. That is that is craziness. Uh, let's go drop off a few odds and sods, shall we? Uh, we'll leave the well, no, the two large eggs are coming with the one regular milk can go in there. In fact, the cheese can go in there too. Uh, we will also drop off the periwinkle. And I think the winter root is used in the root platter. Let's have a look. Where would that be? Where? No, no, no. Where are you? I think there was one root platter somewhere that needed that. Not there, at the very least. To show the sea. Root platter, there we go. So we need cave carrots as well. So I should really bring those across. Where have I stored my cave carrot at the moment? There we go. I cannot believe that we've just done that. That is so amazing. Let's drop off all of that. Also, I'll drop my hat off as well. Okay, well, today has been super amazingly good. Don't worry, Colin. Um, dear Lord, that is gigantic. Hmm. Let's not put it too close to the fire, because that's just dumb. Don't don't put your Christmas trees too close to the fire. It, 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 it won't end well. It'll end very poorly. Uh, in fact, let's have the... 
Flash is kind of guarding the bed there. And we can have those flowers over there. That actually looks not too bad. I want this a little bit. Hmm. I don't know. If It seems like the sort of thing that would look better in a corner rather than out there. So... Yeah, let's let's move some things around. We'll have the uh, have the skeleton down there along with the spinning wheel. Uh, I need to move this chest somewhere. In fact, I'm gonna need to move this window if I do this. I need all of these things out. Unfortunately, I then have no room for everything else uh, for the actual chest itself. But there we go. Right, chest is moved. The chest can be over here. Uh, sure, and we'll move that somewhere else. The chest can just be my special chest. And we'll keep this in the corner in my bedroom. There we go. I think that'll work fine. We'll make it red again. And then drop off all the items that we had inside. Including, well, actually no. Colin, you're coming with me. Yeah, uh, You're going elsewhere. There we go. I think that is all... We need to pop in there. Uh, the rainbow shell can go in there as well. Well, actually, no. The rainbow shell can come with me. You, you can go elsewhere for now. But we do need... No. No, no, no. No, no. Damn it. There we go. I want to put this in the kitchen, actually. Uh, yeah, we'll pop that one there. And then we'll pop the cactus on the other side. There we are. Just flanking the, the chicken. That actually looks quite nice. And you can come with me, and you can go up in the corner. Oh, that looks so much better, though, doesn't it? Than than just having it down there. It really does look so much better. And then we can have the plushies protecting the skeleton. Because, you know, this town is not very accepting of skeletons. You saw what they did. They stuck him in a cage. So uh, we, we will we'll keep this skeleton secret safe. Uh, we'll have a spinning wheel just in front of the Christmas tree. <laughs> Eventually we'll get this place sorted out, but it, it is starting to look a little bit more homely in here, I think. I'm actually pretty happy with the way things are going. Uh, right, can we afford to drop anything off in here? Uh, I'm going to need a bunch more stone so I can make a final cheese press. That's going to be necessary. Colin, we must get more of you. I will. I will have you create more Collins. You you will be the founder of a legacy, a legacy of Collins. It's going to be grand. It, it your your progeny will will be many and varied, and amongst them you shall be legend. Uh, we will drop this off. The crocus. Hmm, I'm going to give that to Jazz. Actually, fairly certain that Jazz Jazz likes those. I should really. Oh, before I do that though. I should super duper check on. There we go, Colin. How many? Two. That's fine. It's fine. It's it, it's a humble beginning. Colin is a very humble corn. But from that humble beginning, it, this is going to be a legacy to to last the ages. Right. We're gonna. Ooh, I'm gonna get rid of that clay I just spotted. Right. We've got a couple of places we want to go. Quite a few, actually. Okay. Where was that? Is it bubbles, or was it something I can pan? Doesn't look like it was something I can pan, and that's the only thing I was really caring about. Uh, catch a squid. That might be difficult, but I'll try it. Alright, let's uh, drink down the coffee, because we've got a lot of moving we need to do. And let's be off. The farm's come together. Slowly but surely. I, th I think we're making some good progress on the farm at the moment. I'm genuinely quite happy with it. Alright, let's go and... Uh, Let's see in here. Hello? Hello? No one? Ugh. Need to... I think this is where I've got to do this. Jack in a box for that. Where's the toy box? There's something. There's somewhere in here, I think. Was there not somewhere I needed to put the strange bun in Jazz's room? Crafts, new. I'm sure there was somewhere in here that I needed to put the strange bun. Hmm. Maybe I've got to right click it? 
No. Maybe it's down here, perhaps? No, I don't want to eat it. I want to put it somewhere. There's somewhere I need to put the strange bun. No, 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 no. Okay, well, I'm going to have to revisit things. I'm going to need to go and check on that book to see what those letters say. First letter of every uh, every word basically tell you where you need to put certain things. I thought I had to... Ooh. Oh, hi. That's a good boy, Dusty. You might be the only one around here who understands me. No one else has seen the kind of stuff you and I have. Me and bushes? What is... what? This is not a normal thing for someone to do. Alak, can you overhear me talking? Uh, well, I'm not going to lie to you. Yeah, I, I, I heard what you said. I don't really like to talk about it, but I guess I'll explain. Have you ever wondered why I live with my grandparents? Uh, I used to wonder that, yeah. You see, my father wasn't a good guy. He, well... He ruined everything for me and my mum. Half the time he was gone, the other half he'd drink all night and tell me I'm worthless, that I'd never amount to anything. I think he resented me for being young. Bitter because he'd wasted his youth doing nothing and had gotten nowhere in life. Unfortunately, I do know a few people like that. And the saddest thing is, I know people who are like that and they're only in their thirties. <laughs> you don't have any reason to be envious of youth when you're only in your 30s. I mean, yeah, okay, you're getting older, but look at what other people have achieved around that age or later than that age, you know? I guess you can sort of see it more in the 40s, 50s, maybe, I don't know, but some people, I don't know. It really hits them hard when they start aging and the people around them don't, and it... As much as I think people think women suffer that worse, I think men kind of hit it harder because it happens more suddenly. Like, women, they start aging earlier, but they age slower. But with men, they're, they're pretty much young until they're not. It, it's it like it happens, they go to sleep, and then they wake up, and then they're old because it's just biology. But, yeah. So... Yeah, unfortunately, this this is not uh, an uncommon situation. Well, that's my take on it anyway. Who knows what was going on in his mind? It's at least good that you're, you're open to the possibility that there may have been more going on. Still, sad that you had to go through it. One day he left, and soon after that, Mum got sick and passed away. I had no choice but to move in with my grandparents. Was Dusty a family dog? You seem like someone I can trust. That's why I'm telling you this, Abek. I don't want any sympathy. Understandable. Is that one good thing about my past is that I ma it made me strong. Just like Ace Rimmer. Now, let me show you what Dusty will do for a barbecued steak. I'll be honest, Alex, there's quite a lot of things I do for a barbecued steak. <laughs> Ha! Look at him slobbering! I think he might like steak as much as I do. Okay, well, we, we're getting a little bit of insight into, uh, into Alex at this point. Lovely tree! I need to go and find Abigail. Right, whose birthdays are when? Yes, it is Linus's birthday on the 3rd. Wait a second, I saw an Abigail over there. Here we go. Ha <laughs> ha, perfect. Here's your reward, Alec. Don't say a word to my dad, though. Shh. So cold, I wish I had a hot cup of coca to share. Mm. No, I, I completely agree. It is bitterly cold at the moment as well. Hello, Lewis. I've got a start coming up with a plan to improve our town next year. Uh, well done. 
Right, I'm going to need some rice sooner probably rather than later. But I'm wondering if I got these right now. Whether I could plant them. And, uh, no, actually, I'm going to leave them as is. It's fine. Sometimes I get new items in stock, so make sure to stop by every so often. Oh, I'll try to. I want to know what what, uh, what trick you're going to play. I think my hair is frozen solid. Um, It's hard to tell it was blue to begin with. How come you guys can just move through each other, but I have to fight for it? You're looking really fit, Jody. Those dumbbells do wonders, don't they? Oh, my arms feel like gelatin. We meet every week to encourage each other to stay healthy. And that is very, very good in my opinion. I'm going to sleep well tonight. Mm -hmm. Exercise is fantastic. It does so many good things. Least of all, makes you tired enough to sleep through pretty much anything. At least if you work pretty hard at it. Uh, oh, Maru. Let's say hello to you as well. It's been a little while. How are you doing? Hey, do you have any ideas for a new gadget I can make? Okay, uh, look. You've, you've more or less turned down all of, all of my criminal mastermind plans, and I think that's because you don't want to build anything that's derivative or, or in, uh, you know, inspired by my plans, because then I'd know how to break it down again. I, I'm on to you. Well done. I, I see where you're coming from there, because you could try to bribe a government, but then I would just offer them the solution, and then they'd pay me, like, almost as much as you were asking to fix the problem. And, I mean, I would happily share it. We should go into a partnership. But, since you're not going for my, my you know, doom weapons, let's try something nice. Um, I think you should make a... Oh, see, so this is really hard. A mechanical device that's nice. I, mean, I can think of plenty of things like like genetically engineered cows that actually do produce strawberry milk or banana milk. That would be fantastic. I can't see how that would go wrong, honestly. I think you should start working on that. And if you accidentally make some sort of vampire cow, then, oh well, you know, it, it was worth the risk. Gus really hates Jojo Cola. I think he might actually be allergic. Well, thank you for the information. Maybe it's Gus who keeps throwing her all into the river. Though that wouldn't make any sense. Because then, he'd eventually have to drink water. And I, I can only assume that they get some of the water... Well, actually, no, the river's running into the ocean, so they're probably okay. There's a lot of ocean out there. It would dilute it quite well. I would like... to pan... There we go. Seriously, little Maru, try not to make any vampire cows. That will only end poorly for all of us. Especially if it's some sort of vampire cow that when it when it bites people, it makes them pregnant with more vampire species of whatever they were. And those those offspring are born pregnant. And it, it's just going to explode the population of vampire cow people. It's It'll go downhill really fast. If you want to make friends with Willy, you can't go wrong with a pumpkin. It's his favorite. Oh, really? Well, I do happen to have quite a lot of those. I was saving this for Jazz, but I haven't seen Jazz. Do you like crocus? This is for me? Marvelous! Oh, you're more than welcome, Elliot. Hello. I don't seem like you have anything to write to the museum. Well, I'm sorry. Where are all these books? I'm fairly certain that it was a new book. Well, Scallywags. Oh, well. Where was the book that told me all of the places that I need to put stuff? I think it was around here somewhere. There, okay. Um, uh, okay. Maybe it's down like this? No. Maybe it's back? Hmm. I'm going to have to write this down and actually look at it off camera. It would take me too long on camera. Uh, right, well, I think we should go to the uh, to the community center, drop off this large milk, get the greenhouse being built tonight, and also visit the, uh, the quarry. The funny thing about the quarry is you can use the minecarts to get there, but you can't do it until the bridge is built. I... 
Did the Junimo also fix the minecart track leading to the quarry as part of of their gift to you for having fixed the 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 bridge? Well, that's an awful lot of work. I feel that uh, we got more out of that than we really deserved. But there we go. The first two days of winter, and we have completed two whole sections. And I've got a cheese press. Well, that's actually kind of marvellous. Wonderful! I really like this one, because it's the, the two rooms, and this makes the whole left side look amazing. So many wonderful bundles! Thank you! Thank you! No, thank you, little Junimo. Look at all of this wonderful food! This is marvellous! And an awesome place to eat it, too. This kitchen is better equipped than mine. Well, actually, no. It looks like it's more or less exactly the same. But it's got a much better table. Let's do a little dance. Now, what remains? We've got to get the Mackie Roll and the Truffle. That's going to take a little while. We need the Red Cabras, Year 2, and the Duck Feather. That's probably going to take a while. We, oh, purple mushroom, of course, yes. And then the nautilus shell. Well, we got the purple mushroom. We need wine, pomegranates, and a rabbit's foot. Now, that can take forever. Uh, we need some hay. We need three apples. That's not actually that hard to do. Over here. This is just pure money. Um, I could start drop, dropping a fair old chunk, actually. Chocolate cakes, sure. Uh, I'll do the five grand one. Quality fertilizer. The rest I'm gonna keep though. Winter is not not a not a time where you make a lot of money, unfortunately. So I don't want to spend it all. But we'll make some progress now towards that. And in the not too terribly distant future, I may be able to get Pam's bus sorted, and then we can go to Calico Desert. Ah, oh, the things we're gonna be able to do. It's gonna be wonderful. I like the I like the little decorations you got outside your house there. It's actually pretty pretty nice. Now we're gonna go over. To, there's so many wiggly worms, but I'm not going to grab them right now, simply because I'm trying to get to the quarry and I'll want to run out of time if I do. So here we are. The quarry has been opened up to us. Let us get ourselves over there, and the quarry is gonna be full of things. Now the quarry generates more ores and more rocks over time but initially the quarry has basically had a very very long time to build up all of this stuff so you you probably won't find the quarry as well uh stocked as this ever again unless you leave it a very long time and then come back but i would recommend not leaving it that long the, the way the quarry works is that it'll, from what people have been able to uh, guess, is that it generates the ores, well, it picks a spot in the quarry to spawn something. And if there's already something there, oh, okay, then it doesn't spawn it. It doesn't pick a new spot, it just doesn't spawn it. However, if there isn't something there, then it'll spawn whatever it was going to spawn. We just picked up some diamonds, that's marvellous. Oh my lord. Over there, that is a very special rock. It has got spirals on. Spiral rocks are special rocks. Let's go and have a look at you. There we go. This will be an iridium bearing stone. Two gold ore, one iridium. Fantastic. I'm not going to go through and mine this place out completely. Some more iridium. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. Maybe we'll be able to get ourselves an iridium sprinkler. We, I don't know. That is asking for an awful lot. But, it would be marvellous if we could. Another Iridium Ore. Three Iridium Ores. We're up to four. <laughs> that's, an, that's unfortunate. If we could have gone to five, then we would have been able to get one Iridium Bar. And I think that's all we would have needed for a Iridium Sprinkler. They water a five by five area with them at the centre. So, effectively... A perimeter of two around themselves. Right, I'm, I'm low on energy, so let's head back. But we can use this to rapidly return to the bus stop, which makes things a lot easier. An awful lot easier, actually. Okay, so that was a fantastically good day. We still need to do a fair bit of work when it comes to getting 
uh, our tools upgraded. We can upgrade our watering can at the moment if we want to. And yeah, I probably do. We did get quite a lot from there, actually. That was that was a particularly good haul. A particularly good haul. Um, got a cheese press there. Can I get another one? Yes, I can. And then I'm going to drop off the wood. Hardwood. The fertilizer won't go in there. Um, the stones will, though. Let's drop off all of these. Oh, we can't drop them all off, unfortunately. Uh, what can I take out? I can. T I guess I can take out the seeds. I don't re strictly need them in there. The geodes can stay with me. We can take out the forage as well. In fact, you know what? Now that we've cleared out the chest, we can actually take a lot of this out with us. I need to put that over here. We do still have some things to go in there, which is kind of funny. Uh, oh, yeah, we want the forage in there, please. Do I have the mushrooms in there yet? No. I do have the mushrooms in here, but we can just drop these off in here. I will get this all sorted. I will eventually get it all sorted. Might not be right away, that's all. Uh, we can actually drop this back off in there now, which is good. Uh, drop off the diamonds, the geodes. Uh, actually, no, I'll keep the geodes on me because I, I really would like to go and get those sorted tomorrow. Uh, the two large eggs. Um, let's go and get those in here. We should have enough time to do everything we want. That'll be gold star mayonnaise. And we'll go and pop down the cheese presses into the barn. We've made fantastic progress. So early in winter, and we've already got the greenhouse. Or we will by tomorrow morning. There we go. And that's all the cheese press that we need. If we get milk every night, uh, every day, then we can get four cheeses every day. And, you know, so it's perfect. All right, it's time for us to return. Or retire. Uh, I think I'll grab five of those and we'll just carry it with us. I'll also make sure to bring the watering can with as well so I can go and get that upgraded. Uh, then, But soon we're going to be able to plant these in the greenhouse. Also, Colin. Colin's offspring. Uh, we'll sell the cheese. And the gold star mayo. In fact, we'll sell all the mayo. There we are. Wonderful. It is time to go to sleep. We have had a very, very good day, in my opinion. Oh, we've also got some jams. I'll go and sell those. Might as well. Oh, Leafin is sleeping by the Christmas tree. That's very sweet. Cranberry jellies. I'll grab two blackberries. Blackberry jelly. There we go. No star Leafin. No star bead. Perfect. To have already completed the greenhouse in the first year, that was that was my goal. And ideally I wanted it before winter, but it doesn't matter. We've got it in winter in the first two days. It, it's, it's perfectly, perfectly fine. Your progress has been saved. Right, well, there we are. That is going to be the end of today's episode. A super Superbly productive day, or rather two days in my opinion. It is now Wednesday the 3rd, so there are a bunch of things that we're going to be able to do today. Namely, we've got to go and get Linus a birthday gift. We also want to sort out our geodes and upgrade the watering can. So busy, busy, busy. But that is going to be it from me. So thank you very much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed. And remember to like if you liked, sub if you haven't. But until next time, do take care.